Here is your winner. And still, World Wrestling Federation Champion, The Undertaker. But one thing you can't deny is since winning those belts several weeks back, they've been able to maintain them and retain those tag titles despite several challenges. It always pans out if you are a good athlete, if you are a good team, and you're good wrestlers, regardless of what level playing field is going to be laid out for you, you're going to perform, you're going to rise to the occasion. And Bischoff and Russo basically could be, oh, what a drop kick, could be just much away from obliterating forever the Millionaire's Club. That's going to be a very difficult thing to do, but certainly in the ring, as we mentioned earlier, this is the future of World Championship Wrestling. Mark Jindrak, Sean O'Hare have the World Tag Team Champions in general, and in particular, Sean Stasiak reeling in the opening minutes of this matchup. Sean O'Hare, tremendous background in athletics, both in gymnastics as well as in shoot fighting, and he just unloads a right hand to the side of the head of perfection, Sean Stasiak. You know that O'Hare, he had that spectacular move from the top a week ago that won the match in their debut here on Worldwide. So you know he's got to be working on a lot of adrenaline, a lot of emotion right now. Feels very good about his Columbo really walked into a great situation. He was just coming into his own when the new blood was, was kind of uh, made official by Bischoff and Russo. And he immediately attacked the total package, what we call, what we call that, and step. How many guys from a power plant, maybe three months out of the power plant, can say they're a world champion? Now you can count those on maybe one finger. and that It was less, a little longer than three months, but obviously Goldberg is probably the only person that's been able to make that kind of a quick transition. Colombo, however, as well, has been able to take advantage of the opening that he's been giving in the perfect event, now using the double team tactics off the spinning neck breaker. Stasiak hook of a leg and a two count on Sean O'Hare. You know, we can talk so much about the great background and the uh, second-generation wrestler that Sean Stasiak is. You can be a second-generation wrestler, but if you can't go, if you don't have the athletic ability, it doesn't do you a bit of good. You're right, that second generation only gets your foot in the door. Right. It's where you take it from there, and Sean Stasiak has proven that he belongs with the stars of WCW. Oh. Colombo, big man, six foot five, 265 pounds, goes airborne, and then goes to the cover, but Jindrak able to come in and break up the pin attempt by Palumbo on O'Hare. It's a great veteran move from a young man, Jindrak, to break the count because Palumbo had a great move. A lot of momentum going his way, but was very, very cocky with the cover, and that kick that time from Jindrak, although maybe it was not needed, was just sending a message to the tag team champions that they're still in it. Sensational agility that time by O'Hare, and then he's able to take Colombo and slam him down to the mat as Colombo came out of the corner. I think he hurt himself though, Mike. I think that time that O'Hare hit as hard as Colombo did. Yeah, both men here having a difficult time to recover would be very important for Sean O'Hare to get to the corner. Get his tag partner, the fresh man Mark Jindrak, into the battle, and probably the same could be said for Colombo. Now both tags are made, and it will be Jindrak and Stasiak. Jindrak, stuck of the clothesline, and then 
Sixers with a pair of clotheslines, a back elbow, and there's a drop kick for Columba. Jindrak with a basketball background, putting the referee has been distracted in there. You see Palumbo with the Lex Flexer, and he just nailed Jindrak in the back. Now with O'Hare out of the matchup, with O'Hare on the floor. The double team tactic by the tag team champion in perfect event. Just throw Jindrak face first to the mat. Legs hook, shoulders down. There's the three count. They keep the tag titles. Well, that's unfortunate for O'Hare and Jindrak that it had to go down that way. But one thing that we have come to know is following the rise of the new world tag team champion the perfect event is that they will take the advantage of using that Lex Flexer when necessary. They found it necessary here in this matchup, and there was nothing uh, Mark Jindrak or John O'Hare could do. John O'Hare's not done. John O'Hare realized what happened. That spin kick was not really on target, but I think Colombo got the message anyway. How about that? The youngster, Sean O'Hare, just cleared the ring of the world. Here's another look at the action in the tag title match. had things going their way. That's uh, just tremendous leg strength by Jindrak that time. Here was the back of Jindrak that The referee was looking to a hair on the outside. The double pancake. 